So our index is pretty high. Uh, here's the thing though. This is our first blind playthrough. When that gets to 100%, we lose presumably. Here's the thing. I got really unlucky on my first playthrough. We didn't find our second Phoenix base till the end of month two. In a month two. So we're like uh, really far behind and we also had a couple setbacks. So uh, tonight though, we're gonna start out We're gonna start out Manicore 3. We're gonna start out uh, doing this quest. Don't get unlucky, get more excited about the experience. Yeah, there we go. Ravens are amazing. I like my wife already. They are, they're really smart. Crazy smart, wicked smart, as some people would say. Definitely not me though. Okay, Manicore 3. Okay. Um, I'm sure we'll be fine. Uh, we might want to put pants on Ash, like, you know, maybe, maybe, um, we, he could probably use some pants. So let's grab some pants from, it's, it's interesting that you can instantly send pants across the world, but not your people, you know? I mean, it would be very strong if we could do that. Uh, what other manticore is here? Manticore 2. So we're about to do a main story quest. And we're leaving another um, group on the other side of the world to defend in case, you know, something bad happens. So, Manticore 2 is here. So, we need to get pants from Manticore 1. So, personnel, let's find a assault that's in Manticore 1. Ooh, count me out some Manticore 1. Ooh. Mm, I don't know about that. We might have to give Salim um, a little something-something if we have no points. Uh... Lunar, I'm stealing your pants. All right. Sorry, Lunar. These pants are mine. Or whoever's. Ash like, I believe. Ash like. So, Ash like, you get some pants. Congratulations. Uh, they are used slightly by Lunar, but you'll get over it. Hanging out. Your friend is living room. Chatting with other folks. Playing the game. Yeah, that's what, I, that's what I try to tell people that I'm, I wanted to make it like. It's like when I was a kid, me and my friends would hang out, like I said, in the living room or whatever. Sit on the couch. One of us would be playing uh, and others would be watching and commentating and asking questions. Trying to figure out things out together. All blind to the game and taking turns, you know. Good times. You ever watch Sinua on stream? Too hyped to see what direction they take? Yeah, I, sh uh, I didn't get to check your, your Discord message. I woke up like 15 minutes before the stream. So I did see that you messaged me, but I'll reply to whatever it is later. Hey Rob, welcome in. Hey Rob. All right, guys, let's do it. Let's do it. Special mission. Special mission. You know, I just got into pantsed, or just pants, I guess. See, I'd never called it pants. So here's the thing, where I grew up, when we talked about some slang terms and stuff from where I grew up in rural Southeast Tennessee in Appalachia, when I was a kid, I'd never heard the word pants. It was called shanking where I was from. I didn't know when I was a kid that shanking meant what it really does. The main definition of shanking from like a prison standpoint, so to say, people getting shanked. So where I was from, uh, having someone pull your pants down was was called shanking. And that's what I, that's what I knew it as my entire life. And then uh, some kid moved into our uh, sc school system or whatever, um, and when I was in high school and, uh, he pulled down someone's pants and he said he pants them and we were all like, pants? What kind of stupid crap is that? Who says pants? Pants sounds like you're putting pants on someone. It's shanking. What's wrong with you? So anyway, uh, that's what it was called where I grew up. Here's trusted dad to comment the first one. I hope so. Hope so. To shank somebody <laughs> stuff got real yeah <laughs> i don't know why that's just what it's called i don't know if i don't know where that where that is from or where it's common but that's what it was when i was a kid so i mean if i had gone somewhere else as a kid yeah maybe i, I could have got in a lot of trouble it's like all right during recess i'm gonna shank them and people were like stay away from that adam kid he's gonna kill someone <laughs> make sure he doesn't have any toothbrushes on him or anything 
This archaeological site may be related to the antediluvian civilization discovered by Randolph Symes III. If we can secure it, it we may be able to figure out where Symes went next. Or pee on them? Uh, that is a mutual agreement. You you agree to a to a match of urinal chicken, all right? All parties know what they're getting into. Some of them are just not ready to lose. Not prepared for a loss. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Huh. Hmm. 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 We don't have enough points to give him Rage Burst and other things. We're gonna have to do this with no Rage Burst. Rage Burst is OP though. So, maybe it'll be good to do it without it so we can be like... What's gonna happen is I'm gonna lose someone, they're gonna die, and after the mission I'll be like, oh, I should've waited, I should've gotten Rage Burst. We would had no losses had I gotten... Oh God, Hot Pockets is going? I don't know, Hot Pockets. I don't know about that. Uh, why am I taking this exact team? That's just who's on this side of the world, you know? You know, uh, we can build a grenade really quick. So, what we do, what we do, is go to manufacturing and we go to equipment and scrap. And there is some stuff here uh, we've gotten recently that we're not going to use. Like the Yet AR, uh, which I don't, I don't really like it. I know this is murder. Uh, for some reason, every time I see the word murder, <laughs> it's kind of weird. Um, not the word, I, I guess the word murder is weird. The style is an Anu shotgun. 40 and 10. Hang on a sec. 40 and 10. 30 and 6. February 20. What? What? We're going to keep that so we can uh, backwards engineer it. But anyway, every time I hear the word murder or see the word murder, um... First thing I think about, it's kind of weird to start a start a conversation this way, but the first thing I think about is um, on How I Met Your Mother. They had this like song in the background every time there was like any kind of fight or whatever, and it's like murder. It's a murder. The song is Murder Train. If you want to look it up, um, and there there's like a specific scene that. Pl that I remember where, like, Marshall and them are talking about how Marshall used to fight with his brothers. They're all teasing him, like, ha ha, yeah, fighting with your siblings, that's nothing. Ha ha ha, rough housing with Coco and stuff like that. And then Marshall, like, lays into someone later into the uh, the show, and it shows a flashback for when he was a, a teenager or something. And they were, like, killing each other, beating each other to a bloody pulp and stuff. They're like, yeah, don't mess with your Uncle Marshall. <laughs> like, apparently he and his brothers seen some stuff anyway i don't know why i always remember that uh all right so who do we need uh ammunition on ammunition so step has two things full you don't even have you don't even have a shirt on it's all right that'll be fine all right, let's go. It's just a late game quest mission. How hard could it be? There's no turning back. I can't believe we didn't lose Tet last night. I'm glad we didn't. But for anyone that didn't see, uh, Tet usually dies very early on in, in these games when he wins a name. And last night, uh, he won a name. We're like, oh crap, Tet's going to lose on his first mission. Gets on his first mission and everything attacks him on round one. Gets him down to uh, six health, I believe it was. Six health. But he lived. He didn't even have any limbs destroyed. So six health, all of his limbs intact. He, we were able to heal him and finish the mission. Tet lives to see another day. All right, let's see how it goes. Candle is alive. Succeed. Yeah, I had no idea when I was a kid that was that shanking thing was a regional deal. All right. Alright. So we have to make it there. That's This is weird. Odd. 
And then we're gonna, I'll bet you we're gonna have to protect that or something, or it's gonna go down somewhere. What's going on with my mouse? My mouse is a little, my mouse feels a little off. I don't know what it is. All right, uh, where's Step? Step? There you are. Okay, we're gonna scout with them because they have pretty high perception. What they are. I'm still not used to playing while standing, it's weird. Okay, we got a siren. He survived the death. Oh, yeah. Yeah, luckily. That siren is really far away. Let's see what else we can spot here. Ooh, that's a lot of enemies. That's the number. All right, what do we got? We got a uh, Arthron with no grenades. So machine gun, which means he has return fire, and spitterhead. Looks like same variant over there. What kind of tritons we got. Pistol tritons. Not as deadly as the other two variants, I don't think, but they do have pain chameleon. Uh, so they will go invisible when we hit them. I'm sure there's other enemies lurking around too. Another machine gun variant there. Uh, all right. So we definitely need to get Salim into a great position to start shooting at these. We'll probably mainly set up overwatches this round. So let's go ahead and get to... Uh, we're, we're really far in that corner. It's going to be hard to get everyone over to uh, to overwatch areas. Um, Salim actually has some shots from back here, but the problem is no cover after those shots. Now, they're so far away... So they probably here's the thing the siren's probably going to use frenzy and, and we can't we can't do anything about that this round there's no way we can destroy the siren's head from where we are and if she uses frenzy it gives her entire um um team 50 percent extra speed which means 50 percent extra movement basically uh, hey peachy pie welcome in peachy pie thank you for the follow by the way while i was offline i appreciate it hi doing pie five in a row what, do you want to live forever, Miss Fortune? Uh, so these are going to probably be able to move pretty close to us. So I'm probably just going to move our sniper up into um, range and get really good shots next round. The enemy does not know we're here yet. We have not alerted them. They will discover this is coming around for sure, though. So we'll just get ready for, uh, for round D. That's two, by the way. Ant, you're hurt? Why are you hurt? Just don't be hurt. It's simple. It's so simple. Ibax in for some boom blasts next round. Hot Pockets. Hot Pockets on their first mission. Hot Pockets, ever since they won a name, was like, Have you taken me yet? Have you taken me yet? Have you taken me yet? Have I gone on a mission? Do I have gear? Do I have weapons? Have you taken me yet? Well, now you're in here. Where are you? Are you in chat? Uh, all right. All right. Okay, I think we're just going to overwatch now and uh, wait and see what happens. So we use the control key and the mouse wheel to overwatch this area and make it a little bit wider. That way, if that guy moves in front of that uh, full cover, we'll shoot him. Tet, we're going to overwatch you this way. Again, kind of wide, but within that that right there. I doubt Tat's going to get shot like here. If he does, great. Something about the great boy. Uprise of 20 or by Uprise of 2021. <laughs> um, what's your husband's name? If you don't mind me asking. That's awesome. Well, thank you for checking us out. I'll let your husband know that you checked me out. Uh, <laughs> all right. Our sniper will do pistol overwatch. They don't have enough points to do the sniper overwatch, unfortunately. You know what? I'm going to overwatch it this way. This way. The Great Bot Uprising. Uh, we're not going to be able to overwatch over that. So we'll just chill. Chill. Oh, Phobus Hammer. Gotcha. He's sitting there and he knows. Hey, Hammer. Uh, but no, seriously, thank, thank you guys for watching. Watching and lurking. It all helps out. Really, really. Alright, that's all we can do, guys. See if they find us. Ken! Thank you for the lurk, Ken. Uh, 
There's Siren number two. Okay, they have good perception, so they have already spotted us. It is now alerted to our presence. That one has not, though, and is going the other way, which is good for us. Did you guys see that? There was like a little, uh, it was very hard to see, but there was like a little area of light like that appears under them as they move, but it was just by itself and it like moved around. I don't know, maybe maybe the game's playing tricks on me or maybe there's actually something there that we didn't see that's very fast. Ah, some decent overwatches. Nothing to uh, write home about, you know. Yeah, there, there it is. It's that other uh, grenade guy right there. I can see him now. That was kind of weird. We can see the lights, like his, uh, ooh. What do you want to call that? I don't even know. Their reverse shadow? We see it's reverse shadow moving. That's a lot of enemies. We saw it too? Yeah. It's kind of interesting because we, it kind of let us cheat and know where that enemy was. Holy crap. That's a lot of enemies. Does it sound lower to you than normal? Windows had an update. It sounds fine to me, but let me know. Does the sound on shots and things seem low to everyone else? I had a Windows update. And sometimes Windows update screws my sound. Sounds fine to you. Hmm. Yeah, let me know. When's Remote coming back? Uh, we'll be back to Remote after Phoenix Point. Yeah, I was. I mentioned that. What's going on with my mouse? We just had that at the beginning of the stream dots, but uh, other people have asked too, and I, I'm definitely not going to leave that uh, on a cliffhanger forever. We will go back to that Remworld save um, after Phoenix Point. Oh my goodness, look at this, guys. The game sound is low. Um. Windows update, I guess. Um, hmm. I'll have to check the settings, like, not in the in-game settings. Well, I mean, I can turn it up in-game, but I'm worried. I did, by the way, not. Welcome back. If I, if I change the in-game setting, it's going to be too loud for me, but... I guess I can just do that. Were alerts really quiet to you guys? Not too bad, though. But lower than normal. Freaking Windows updates, man. Windows update always screws my uh, sound settings. I'll just do it on the game end. It's a lot of enemies. It is. Let me know if that's better. Kills your sound settings. Yeah, it's, it, that's always. It resets my camera and my sound. The camera, I have um, written down the exact sound, or I mean the exact settings, so I can, you know, put it back exactly where it was, but. All right. So, what kind of shots we have here? We have shots on just Arthrons, right? With our sniper. So, we're going to try to take those out. Uh, how close is the siren? The sirens are not close enough to worry about this round. We just need to take as many things out nearby as we can. Um, Step's going to hit a bunch of trees. And for work with Scott? Man, not... I appreciate it. I mean, never expected, but obviously appreciated if you decide to do so. Crazy nuts. And congrats, by the way. I mean, how long did it take for you to uh, get cleared for it? I feel like a lot of people have mentioned that this that system is incredibly slow, which should be the opposite, because when you need it, I mean, you need it soon. I didn't stop me, by the way. Welcome back. So, Step can get four grenade hits in, and then we can go from there. Um, the thing is, these need to be really good hits. I guess, obviously, they need to be really good hits. Because he's going to be left with no cover if we do all of those. I'm going to do it, though. Almost a month first time. We broke a heel. Yeah, I remember that. Only a week this time? Okay. 
Man, that would have been terrible if you had to wait another month. All right, Jimlin Rush. Hey, Ignu. Welcome in. How you doing, Ignu? Lunar, welcome back. Lunar, I took your pants. You missed it. <laughs> Lunar, someone else needed your pants, all right? So I took your pants and I gave them to someone else. Uh, hopefully you don't mind. All right. So we're going to hit this one with a grenade, hopefully. Step in the past has been really bad with grenades. Let's see if he actually hits this one. Oh, I didn't realize that one. I should have checked, man. I should have checked if we were in. Oh my god, Step is almost dead from that. Not a fan of pants. The one your skirts have issues. No, your skirts are intact, just pants. That was really uh, not good. Really, really not good. Um. That one's behind that shield, so we don't have a great shot at it. So we do 100 damage. We take two shots to kill. I'm gonna have to heal step this time. Surrounds. Safe. Or you don't have pants on. Congrats. Hey, Hammer, welcome back. Of yours broke his hip. It took almost two and a half months. That's crazy, man. But I mean, it, you need you need it, obviously. Like, way before that. Alright. I'm gonna boom blast with Ivax. When you just try to clear these guys out. Alright, Ivax. Hey, Trevor. Welcome back. How you doing, Trevor? I had, had a discussion. It involves yelling and violence. What? I, I know that's not true. You don't believe in violence, right? Right, Lunar? Let's go ahead and heal. Step. Actually, I wonder if they do return fire if you heal. I don't know. I don't know if they do. I've never, I've never tested that. Now's not really a good time to test it. <laughs> The problem is, though, if that grenade hits that tree, Steph's going to be hurting real bad. Be a terrible soldier if didn't believe in violence. Yeah, I guess that's that's a good point. If we hit, the, if IMAX hits the tree, Step dies. So let's wait on that. So. Let's try this. All right. Let's see if we can get a kill on someone else. Tet. Hot pockets. Hot pockets. Let's boom blast. Uh, boom blast you. Come on, hot pockets. First mission, first kill. Let's do it. How was the day? It was alright. It was alright. Kind of a long day, but. Did not get the kill. Uh. Maybe I do take that sniper shot. I mean, they don't have very many sniper shots anyway. Yeah, let's do it. So we're going to quick aim. It's going to drop our sniper down to two actions from three. And give us 25% more aim. We're going to finish this one off. Kaboom. Um, and we're going to quick aim again. Hey, bit of squirrel. Welcome in. Mod wife, Target. you're up or just checking in? Is your head still hurting? Uh, what shot is that? That's actually a good shot. We might save that because we can kill that with someone else. All right, Tet. Good luck, Tet. Pushing on. Good luck, Tet. Alright, Ted does have a shotgun. That pain is trout to your neck, shoulders now. Ready to engage. But you're happy about it. <laughs> Alright, we have to remove this arm. Or else. He's going to retaliate. Job, Ted. Job, Ted. Now we have to remove his life. 
or else he will retaliate. Okay, his life has been removed. No more life for that guy. Okay. Minus two willpower. So now we have Ivax's Boom Blast remaining. Uh, we can hit this one. We can hit these guys. The problem with hitting those Tritons... Bitter Squirrel, thank you for the five bits. Stay fresh, cheesebacks. <laughs> Thanks. The problem with hitting that Triton is that it is going to go invisible. There's already an invisible one here. But we can get a two for one here, you know? Two for one. So let's go for it. Come on, Ivax. Two for one, buddy. Don't hit any trees. All right, he only hit one, unfortunately. We got one more grenade. Our community. We go for it. Suede Denim Secret Police. It's <laughs> a long name. That's longer than my name. Suede. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it, Suede. Welcome in. It's not often I see names longer than mine on Twitch. Oh, Hot Pockets missed. That really sucks. Okay, so let's go from here. Um, we have a sniper shot, which is pretty decent with quick aim. It's not the greatest, but we can disable that arm. That is the arm that carries the machine gun. Uh, so we will do that. Hopefully, it could miss and hit the shield. We're going to kind of aim on this side a little bit. There we go. Missed, hit the shield. Ugh. Ugh. It's a mighty long name you got there. Go forth. Just within the limit. Yeah, I'd say it has to be close, man. Thank you, Swade. Alright, so we got a heal step for sure. Um, we could launch three more grenades with step, though. And so can we heal you with someone else? Can we get you healed? Ashlight could heal you. Let's do that. Let's do that. Because then we can uh, get those three grenade hits. That would be fantastic. So we'll switch over to this. It's going to take two action points. Well worth it, though. Lucky he didn't have any uh, body parts destroyed or anything. Ashlight will probably go there after this. Okay, so we can shoot three more grenades. We know there's a there's a Triton here who's stealth with a pistol. But we're going to try to lay down uh, fire on these guys. It's not going to hit that tree right, right beside you, right? Right? Step has just been really bad with grenades this whole time. It's weird. I'll take the same uh, exact grenade shots on Ivax. And they'll hit like every time. Three hits, yeah. Alright. Well, that one was good. It took a lot of grenades to do that, though, unfortunately. So, uh, he's going to bleed out three turns just shy of bleeding out in two turns uh we destroyed his machine gun though so all he can do now is spit and he has to be within six tiles to spit so he's pretty much done okay so i think we actually pull back and overwatch pull back and overwatch from here so Ash will get you into full cover. Steps a little bit exposed. Uh, we could use Rally the Troops on someone. So Ants can use Rally the Troops to get everyone one more action point. So we can get into uh, better positioning for these Overwatches. It'd also give us another grenade shot, huh? Let's do that. So we're going to bring Furby up here. Has everyone used at least one action? So we get the best bang for our buck, yeah. It doesn't re 
store it on the person that uses it. Ants has got some damage on him, which is a little worrisome. Just a little little damage, but I mean, obviously he's closer to dying than if he was at full health. Uh, so Step actually can get one more shot off, but now he's like right under the tree. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna shoot it here since we know there's a Triton there. I don't know. Like the the thing is, I would like to do hit it here. Like if we do any damage to that one, he's gonna bleed out. The only problem is now we're directly under this tree. Uh, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it though. Come on, Step. Don't let me down. I'm telling you, I told, I talked about last night. I'm thinking about not taking step with us any longer. <laughs> like, uh, I just don't know about him. Just don't know. I'm not thinking of the lurk. Oh uh, man. All right, got cover there. Ivax, we can start moving you forward for a better shot next round. Same thing with Hot Pockets. Uh, we can Overwatch here, or we can take a shot. That's not a great shot, so we are probably going to Overwatch. So let's do a nice, narrow Overwatch through this. Okay. Fresh bag of cheddar. You know, cheese bag? Pistol Overwatch through this. Uh, this might be rough, man. There's an awful lot of uh, enemies over there. An awful lot of enemies. We'll do a really tight Overwatch this way. Just a habit there. Good luck to us. There's a lot of enemies. There's like 10 enemies over there. I don't even have my A-team with me. Dun, 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 dun. No, it's not the 18, by the way. I went into uh, Indiana Jones. Almost. They're similar. Indiana Jones, 18. The the tunes are similar-ish. <laughs> A lot of enemies for us to miss, yeah. Step, man. Step just misses everything. Apparently, Hot Pocket learned from Step. Okay, that one's a Pistol Triton. Ooh, 40 damage. There's still quite a few over there that get to take actions this round. Cheese, parents of Parmesan and mozzarella. That's some delicious parents you have there. Oh, come on, man. She instilled frenzy, so now they all have 50% extra speed. Lots of overwatch over there. For the next month. Uh, if you have Amazon Prime, there's a lot of like Prime originals. Um, the Expanse has been... The Expanse has been recommended to me over and over. And The Boys and Hannah. Um, hmm. Back to Lurk. I'm, I'm, I'm not caught up on very many movies, but I know those are all... Uh, popularly recommended things. Uh, Alright, so we're going to have to heal them this round. But let's get some shots in first. Let's see, what does our sniper have shots on? I think we grenade first. Actually, I don't know. If we have a shot... We need to... She's going to get close enough to mind control next round. So we need to destroy the siren's head this round. Want food right now? Nothing else? It's always good. So we could boom blast with Ivax and see where he can reach first off. Mandalorian. Oh yeah, that's another one that gets recommended a lot. Uh, I still need to watch that too. Alright. So we're going after the Siren predominantly. Okay, Ivax. Aim at her head. See if Ivax has better grenades than our other two heavies. 58 damage. Damage her head. Very nice. Very nice. One more IMAX. We're going to go to either disable her head or to... Yep. 
well, don't worry about that tree anymore. So, got that going for us. <sighs> anyway, we're going to go uh, disable her head or kill her. Sniper does not have shots on her yet. So, I am going to go ahead and... Uh, who else do we have heals on? Just on step. Mm. Let's see what that's about. Claim for the next shot. Cool. Yeah, if we survive the next shot. Hey, cheese. Need to arm or something? Is it cannibalism if you eat yourself? I think so. I think it must be. So that one's dead, right? Yeah, that one's dead. What's her head at? 112, 26 armor. I think we go ahead and boom blast on, uh, on Hot Pockets as well. See what we can get done. Actually, on Hot Pockets, we get Adrenaline Rush. If we don't need Boom Blast to reach, oh, uh, we do. So if we if we Adrenaline Rush, we could kill this guy probably if they all hit. But we can't reach her. She's our main concern next round. So we could use Boom Blast and Adrenaline Rush. I think we have to. Then we get four long range grenades. Auto cannibalism, if you eat yourself. I do, by the way, Taff, welcome back. Today I learned. Uh, all right. Boom blast. Gives us range. Adrenaline rush. There's a lot of will points there. 10 in order to shoot these grenades far enough and uh, hopefully hit this stupid thing. Come on, Hot Pockets, do better than Step Knight, please. Good. Where does that where's that one go? Oh, we're right by her. Awesome. So hopefully we hit her and the Triton here. Hey. Yeah, there's the Triton. It's bleeding. Very nice. Very nice. Look at this. It's just step night. This person's on their first mission. They're hitting more grenades than Step Knight. All right, one more. Maybe take out that Triton and her. That would be awesome, awesome. Okay. Uh, that's still bleeding, so... Did not take that one out. She still has her head. Barely. We can kill her pretty easily. Uh, with someone. All right. So what all do we have left? We still have our snipes. Our sniper could actually take her out now. Okay. Let's do that. So quick aim drops our sniper cost down to two from three. So we can get two shots in. Also increase our accuracy by 25%. So we can just finish her off. And if it hits the thing bleeding in front of her along the way instead and kills it. Fantastic. Not quite, but she's dead. So that's still alive. We can see it bleeding out there. Okay. So Ash like. We gotta get Tet healed this round. Gotta do that. So Tet, we're gonna bring you around here to get healed. <gasps> oh, I should have counted the tiles. I usually count the tiles. So this guy's Overwatch is only 10 tiles long. It must he must have been right at the edge of that 10 tiles. Man. That's uh Sorry, Tet. <laughs> my my bad. Why is it always Tet? Why is it always Tet? Well, we don't have to read that Overwatch now. Uh strategizing. Yeah. Alright, step night. Um We could use Adrenaline Rush and shoot two grenades, or we could use we blast shoot one further. We also just get them out of the way, but I kind of want to hit this so we can kill it before it goes in and restores itself. Uh, we need to use five willpower to do that. So Ashlight could definitely dash over here and take this guy out. What's our sniper have remaining? Let's take our sniper shot first. I don't think we're gonna open up anything else with our sniper, so. 
We might as well go ahead and take this shot. Actually, oh, we have a shot on the Arthron way over there. Right, that's the one we disabled the arm a long time ago? Yeah, we can take its leg out too. Alright, let's wait on that. It's not this one, which is what I thought the shot was going to be on. Okay. So, let's go ahead and take um, Ash Like. They have full willpower. Now, this guy does have retaliating fire. So, if we're within 10 tiles and we shoot and we don't destroy his arm, he's going to shoot back. Uh, so, what we're going to do, we're going to get close enough to we, where we can just destroy that arm on our first shot. Kill him on the second shot. We just spotted a Triton. Another Triton. What kind are you? Another Pistol Triton. I mean, I guess at least they're Pistol Tritons. Uh, they can get more shots in, but overall, uh, they seem to do way less damage. Okay, arm is gone. Life is gone. Okay. So we don't want to leave them over here, so we will use a dash to get back. At least one dash. Okay. Uh, we just spotted another siren. A frenzied siren way over there. She's not close enough to really matter. I don't know, though. She has... Yeah, she's still not close enough. But all these ones with that frenzy icon, that's what that purple icon is, can move 50% further. They have 50% more speed. It's a goner. That's still hurting, man. Even after that heal, he's still hurting. He does have a lot of willpower still. Um, you know... We could use Adrenaline Rush and actually get all three grenades off with Tet's uh, Rally the Troops. Yeah, let's do that. The more we can damage and kill on this round, I mean, obviously the better. We don't have to worry about cover as much then. We're probably just going to destroy that tree, but... You know. Oh well. Never liked that tree anyway. Screw that tree in particular. God, he's such a bad shot. Oh, he killed it! I mean, great shooting. And then we uh, revealed, or didn't reveal, but we know where the other stealth one is right here. It's fine, everything's fine. Probably. What a terrible shot, man. I don't know what it is about that character. It's just not very accurate. <laughs> All right, so Tet. Uh, can we actually just adrenaline rush back here instead? Yeah, I'll do that. We can, t we can double adrenaline rush it. Hang on. Do they have a free reload up? They do. Definitely buying this game, Doc. It's good. If you decide to buy it, you can buy it through Exclamation Humble. It supports the stream. Or when you check out at Epic, just type Adam vs. Everything on the checkout page uh, where it says creator code. It'll help stream out, Doc. Both of those are affiliate... Um, or I'm affiliated with Humble and with Epic in those ways. But uh, I, it's a lot of fun. It's not a perfect game, but there's few, if any, games I would say that are perfect or near perfect. All right, let's take this. Uh, I kind of wish our sniper could hit here, but they can't. Um, we can, So we're going to take this one. Uh, Exclamation Humble. Just Humble. Maybe I should make an Exclamation Bundle also, just to cover all bases. We're going to try to take this leg out. It's not a perfect shot. There is a... Uh, it's a pretty good shot. Probably like high 80s, 90s. New Path of Exile League is a blast. Uh, missed. Missed. Uh, high percent shot. Missed, missed, missed. Thank you, Luna. Refall is important. Uh, I just don't have time to play Path of Exile right now. But it is a fun game. All right, so Ant, we're going to use um, Rally Troops again. It's going to give everyone else plus one action points. Let's make sure all four ways. <laughs> okay, we're going to do uh, one more shot here. Come on, step! This mission was better for you, Bolio. Hey, Bolio, welcome back. Step, why are you so bad? <laughs> why? <laughs> Hipster, welcome in. How you doing, Hipster? How you doing, by the way, Zandroff? Raider, welcome in. Why are they so bad? Why? 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 
<laughs> step. Man, I don't know what to say. Uh, we didn't use adrenaline on them. Okay, Hot Pocket, can you do it? Can you hit here? Please? There's a Triton. That's Pink Million right there. Not really. I might got a little bit leveled though. Yeah. It's not my A team that we have, which is one problem, but. Yeah. Okay. A little worried about this one. It, he's not frenzied, but he might get over here and take multiple pistol shots. If I rally on Tet, takes two. He won't be able to overwatch, but then we get one more... We get two more grenades out of it. Are we going to freaking hit that thing with the grenades is the question. We're going to go through all of our, our grenades trying to trying to hit it. I think we just don't worry about it. I think we... Uh, we take Furby up here. We overwatch. He might get into range, too. He's a... Uh, luckily, they don't have grenades. It's not the greatest of Overwatch positions either. Uh, I think I'm gonna do that though. I'm just gonna Overwatch from there. We could take shots, they're not good though. That one's gonna bleed out anyway and the other shot's terrible. Okay. Uh, Salim, you can pistol Overwatch. Got a really tight pistol Overwatch this way, just in case. I don't think that's gonna end up paying out for anything though. Shoots, I did shoots. Beating the pig. Beating the pig. Um. Let's see, ants. I might actually dash them to be able to overwatch to help protect this area. Kind of hate doing that, but I'm afraid if we leave Ted exposed like that in this direction, he's going to be gone, a goner. Okay. Alright, Overwatch it is. No die tonight? No, not tonight. There's still time, but not yet. <laughs> sure wish I had Soleem on this mission. Or not Soleem, uh, count me out. Right, our A-team sniper. But we do not... All right, see what happens. All right, that one bled out, which is good. That lowers the uh, willpower on its ally nearby too. It's just Exhalation Pig. It's a bad hit. Right through full cover, 60 damage. We're running out of heals too. I think we might have one heal left in an inventory somewhere. Please don't take a shot. That frenzy is really screwing us up. If that Triton takes a pistol shot on them and hits, might be done. Hey, Lobby. No, I have not looked at it yet. Um, I've been busy all day, and then I woke up 15 minutes before stream. Woo, good thing that missed. Hi, dude, Lobby. Welcome in. We're going to take another one, probably. Ah, oh, come on. Get over with. You do it or switch to someone else's turn. Stop screwing around. Ooh. That one has frenzy. This might be it. Nope. Oh, my God. I think they're going to live, at least for this round. God, Sirens with Frenzy can move forever. 20 damage Overwatch. Good wife, kid. Good boy, he's cheap fun, yeah? No, I haven't. Oh, thank God that missed.
I was just pooping out mist over there. Speaking of mist, but no, we we ever done done the fondue thing. We went uh, somewhere once a long time ago with like a chocolate fountain or whatever. It's basically the same sort of situation, you know. But fondue on Christmas Eve, often. What is going on with my mouse tonight? I don't I don't know. My mouse has been screwing up lately. All right, we need a really good turn. We need to uh, kill or disable her head. What willpower is she at? She can't panic while frenzied is the problem. So we need to destroy her head so that uh, she can't mind control. <sighs> uh, and we need to try to target the ones with frenzy first off. Something different with the kid? Give it a shot. Really easy and fun. Blame it on the mouse. Well, I'm not blaming anything on the mouse yet, but the mouse really is doing weird stuff tonight. Okay. Hmm. So we don't like cheese? Yeah. I like cheese. My wife isn't a great fan of melted cheese, though, so she probably doesn't want to do it. <laughs> um, if we get a kill that gives it willpower, that'd be really nice, because then we can uh, use Boom Blast on them or Adrenaline Rush. Staff is out of ammo. We're going to do this free reload. Put sub, enter your sub. Please fix. It's true. It's true. So we can use... Um... Oh my lord. Is that really all you have left? Is two shots? That's it. Step has two shots left, and then they're they're out. Wow. Okay. Can we get more bragging? What's bragging the title? Uh, the title is informing. I don't think it's bragging. Halak. Uh, lots of people come in and they say. Lots of people come in and they say, What difficulty are you playing on? And I tell them. And a lot of people say, Is this your first time? And I tell them. So, now people read the title. They don't have to ask. Alright, we're going to boom blast on Ivax for sure. He also only has, uh, he has a reload left. A new subscriber. Come, steal yourself. Lobby. <laughs> Fifth Lobby, thank you for the gift subs. Ten gift subs to Vayne for the third month. You're leaking for their third month. Uh, Talister, uh, Nyan's Sleazy, Z-Man for the first. Chili Finger for their second. S8 for the first. Uh, Mira and Siege for their first. Man, Lobby, thank you for all the gift subs. Love the sandwiches to Lobby. Thank you, Lobby. Very much appreciated. The title is intimidating. Well, it's just informative. It's to tell people what we're doing, right? So, I think it does its job, but no worries. People don't read. Man, Lobby, thank you for all the gift subs, man. Very much appreciated. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. Lunar! Lunar, I think we're the resub. 17 months! We just locked in the same closet you're, you've locked the eight ball in? Yes. Cletus will get out for the eight ball though. Lunar, thank you for the uh <laughs> you were 17 one 17 months, Lunar. Very much appreciated. Thank you, Lunar. Might use Mark for death. 70 months is a long time. Love and sandwiches to Lunar as well. Let's see how badly this goes, Taff. Ugh, I know, I'm taking my time though. I doing Talister. Thank you again, Lobby. Thank you again, uh, Lunar. <sighs> we can use Mark for death on it. But I'm thinking about using both quick aims. Let's use quick aim first. See what our shot looks like. See the projected damage. Oh, you already did it? Yeah. One second. Uh, not right now. Okay, here. 
my daughter just did her Star Wars advent calendar and got a Lego droid, and she wants me to show you. So here it is. <laughs> There's her Lego droid. Thank you, Chili. Nice droid. Stream, are we in a bad situation with low ammo? We are, yeah. We are, which is why I'm slow playing here, trying to figure out what I want to do. We can destroy the head in two hits. Since she's frenzied, she'll still uh, not panic, though. Um, so we might end up hitting her with a grenade first. The thing is... If we remove her head, she's not going to be able to mind control anyone that's above zero willpower. And she's also not going to be able to use Psychic Stream. Um, she will be able to attack. But that might be, be a big deal. Love the Legos. You're that age. They're friggin' expensive now, man. They're like more expensive than golds. <sighs> Alright. Furby. I'm going to try to get some kills with you, man. Godspeed, Furby. Space Marines have chain swords. Your chain sword? No. Like, no, we don't have chain swords, unfortunately. Good. This guy has Overwatch. How you doing, R Square? Welcome in. Bit of a work to finish up. Be lurking. Check in, say hi. Hey, R Square. Thank you for the lurk. Good luck on the work. Okay. If we if we destroy the torso. It can't use Pain Chameleon. Um, 48 times 8. Okay. Or we just kill it. <laughs> we just kill it. Hang on. Hang on. Do I want to use Adrenaline Rush? Can we kill enough with him that Adrenaline Rush makes sense? I think so. So we also have, um, do we have one rally of the troops left? We have one rally of the troops left. We have two rallies left. Yeah, we do it. We do it. All right, Furby. It's go time. How you doing, Littlefinger? Welcome back. Observius, good to see you. How you doing, by the way, Meta War? Hi, Lumini. Good to see you again. All right, yeah, we do it. Drill and Rush will make it so um, our shots only cost one. So when we try to dash around and kill as many as we can. Can we get more shot? I don't know if we get more that way. Because how many dashes do we have? We have three dashes. But that's only two shots. If we... Do Adrenaline Rush. We have only one dash remaining. Well, we probably have two after we get a kill because of the willpower. Two dashes, and we get to move more with blue moves. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. Plus, we also have the two rallies. All right. Good luck, Furby. Take out as many of them as you can, man. Where's that spot? There it is. Or hate, brace the dark side. <sighs> All right, gotta be careful with that. There's an Overwatch there too. Um, I have access Boom Blast. So if we can take out these Overwatch spots here. I have only has a few grenades remaining though. All right, we can shoot here. It's not a great as great of a shot, but I think we can stack our attacks more that way. But we also have other grenades to hit there. All right, we're gonna go for this one. Come on, Ivax, we need a really good hit, man. Prancer, Donner, and Vixen. Comet and Cubit. Donner and Blitzen. 
Uh, no, they don't get to come. Ooh, got it. Yeah, I can't dash when using it. So it's going to be kind of rough. But that's what I'm hoping it still pans out with the extra attack or extra. Um, so that one's dead. All you can do is spit. He's going to bleed out in two rounds. Uh, with the rallies, I'm hoping this will be worth worthwhile. But yeah, we're done. We're done dashing. Might, might not have been the greatest idea, but uh, we're going to go for it. Okay, so we still have Tet with Rally. Step has two shots remaining. That's it. We could do Armor Break on both. We get Adrenaline Rush. Get our two grenades and then... That's it. They're done, man. They're done after that. This is going to be rough. It's against daddies. Hot Pocket, what do you have left? Hot Pocket has one shot. One opportunity. Okay, so Hot Pocket, let's move up to uh, a slightly better shot. take that how far can you throw the fire grenade actually yeah not far we could use armor break on them it's almost like we might as well i hate leaving them at zero yeah i'm gonna do it gotta use everything we can chance to blow mom spaghetti mom spaghetti knees weak mom spaghetti all right, Hot Pockets. I'm actually thinking about going after this one. His Overwatch is gone. Nah, we're all right. Minus 70 armor. It's pretty decent shred. Okay. You still have your weapon. You still have your weapon. You still have yours. So, Step has their two grenades and then they're done. We can armor break both of them. Can you reach people without? Yeah. I think we do that. <sighs> armor break. This is the do or die round for sure. All right. Step is out of ammo after this. 60 damage minus 40. Uh, what's her armor looking like? Her armor is completely shredded, so we can kill her pretty easily. So who else do we want to shred armor on? Oh, crap. I forgot. Whoops. Uh, I meant to use... Um, I meant to use Boom Blast after that. Or Adrenaline Rush. I completely forgot to do so. Screw it. This is our last shot anyway. Okay, there. there's a Triton. I'm going to go for the double here. Come on, step. I need a max damage here. Didn't get a double. Okay, so let's wait on Furby. We disabled that one's uh, shield arm. What do we have on our sniper now? Our sniper has a shot on the Siren. On that Arthron, which is a kill, most likely. Okay. Can we get back here and kill this one with anyone? Tet has all of his dashes remaining, but we want to use Rally of the Troops if we can. Uh, Hot Pockets could reload for free. Ant also has Rally, which we're going to probably use. Oh, 
the community grows. Okay, I think we take Tet over here to try to kill this guy. It's going to take most of his dashes, but I think it's worth. Hey, Preacher, welcome back. How are you, Preacher? Pyros 2002. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. All right. Come on, Tet. We have to take out... Uh, we either have to kill him this round, or we have to take out his gun. Can we one-shot him? Good job, Tet. Okay. So our sniper... We already have quick aim up. What's the shot on this Arthron? It looked like we had a kill shot on it at one point. Yeah, we, we killed that one. What's he at right now, though? That's the one that doesn't really matter, right? All he can do is spit, and he's dead in two turns from bleed. So we don't want to waste our snipe on that with so many things up. So we could get the Siren close to dying. We can attack the Far Arthron. I think we do that. Stay with its leg. Good. Okay. So Furby. Can you get a kill from here or do you need to go in close? You're going to need to go in close. All right. Uh, these both have their weapons, though, so they're going to retaliate. Is there any way we kill them before we do that? <sighs> Ash, like, is there anyone that can heal you? I don't think so. Let's check inventories. I'm pretty sure someone has a heal in their inventory. Tat has a heal in his inventory. Okay. We have a heal in Salim's inventory. Is this getting beat up? Uh, it's a quest mission where we're trying to find Simon's research. And there was like, I don't know, 10 to 15 enemies. <laughs> so yeah, we've been pretty beat up for sure. God, I really need to take those ones out. We're going to get return fire. Is there any way I kill this one? right now what's Tet's shot look like uh, Tet does have some dashes left return fire might actually hit her if I put Tet here it's very risky uh, and we might need to Ash like is so low in health. They're gonna end up doing uh, dash and trying to kill these. We gotta save rally the troops. All right. Here's what I'm gonna try. That one's panicked, so we don't have to worry about that one. Anyone else panicked? No. All right, so we're going to dash over here, try to one-shot this one. I have absolutely none in your game. Or weapons. Uh, how does technology progression work? Uh, there's not really upgrades, so to say. There are side grades. Everything is kind of a side grade for weaponry. So, like, depending on which faction you ally with, when you get to a certain percentage allied with them, it opens up researches. Um, you can also get weapons, you know, pick up weapons off the ground throughout the game. But weapons are more of a side grade. Like some weapons do more damage, some pierce more armor, some shred armor, some give or put poison or paralysis. Uh, so it just depends on what kind of weapon you need in that situation. Yeah, befriending or raiding factions, taking weapons, yeah. Ok, 
Okay, so we know that one's right there. <sighs> this is really dicey, man. If I go there and that one, it's almost it's almost like we gotta kill those two first, but they both have return fire still. I think we gotta try to take one out with our sniper. As crappy as that is, I think we have to. We're probably gonna lose someone this round or uh, this next round, unless we can get enough panicked. Can she kill this one? Yeah, we can kill it, and we don't have to worry about its return fire. All right, let's do it. Okay, the frenzy ones can't panic, which is really hurting us too. All right, so now we try to get Tet over here to finish this one off. But yeah, there's there's not like direct upgrade, so to say, in this. Um, it depends on what you're fighting and uh, kind of what strategy you're you're doing, right? So instead of just obvious direct upgrades like an XCOM. It's not a, it's not a kill set. We're going to have to get you around to this side to do it, and that's your last dash. But then you will have another point. Um, hmm. You'll still have another point with Rally. How many points is this going to take? Let's go ahead and use Rally. If everyone's at least spent one action point, we can go ahead and use Rally. So Ant is the one that uses Rally. Yeah, everyone's good. So, Ants, use Rally. It's going to give everyone plus one action points. Simon this out. Aliens by capturing and dissecting aliens. Yep. Yeah. Uh, vivisections. The, f the first vivisection you do on each alien will also give you 10% uh, bonus damage on that alien going forward. I want to get his art. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh, man. Tet might be dead. All right. All right. I wish I knew if that one was panicked. It's probably frenzied, which means it's can't, it can't panic. They're out of ammo. They can do nothing else. Solim. Also kind of... Kind of done. We got one more shot on Ash Like. We know there's a Triton right there. That Triton we don't have to worry about. Ant has a shot remaining, or. Yeah, they have one dash. Not a great shot. This is going to be a really terrible next round. I think we've cleared about as much as we could have hoped for. Um, we can destroy her head pretty easily. Probably just kill her. Kill that one. Uh, we're gonna be in some trouble big trouble oh well kill what we can there's a triton right here very concerning okay well she's dead so she's not concerned anymore uh, this guy has can only spit so he's not a huge concern but we do need to kill him too Means we need to get Tet out of the way. We have some pistol shots left. We have quick aim pistol shots. We can do four of those. Okay. Um, we're going to take shots from at least two Tritons. Other than that, I think we look okay. We got to kill this guy. Can we do it with pistol shots? Wish I could see how good of an aim that is. How good is the pistol shot on that? That's that's the Arthron that's gonna bleed out. All right. I'm gonna take it. We gotta take the risk. I think these are all the enemies that are left. Like if we can do this, it'll be fine. So quick aim. It's gonna make it so our pistol is free for the next shot. Yeah, 
and a miss. Quick aim, let's do that again. Sixty, is he gonna bleed out? Yep, he's gonna bleed out. Awesome. Okay, where is this Triton? There's a Triton right here somewhere. So it won't show. Hmm. Wonder if that there's where that one is. Maybe. It's hard to tell. I wonder if that one's actually dead. There's a there is a bug that when you kill them when they're invisible, sometimes it leaves a sound signature. Yeah, thank you, super glue. I think that's where that one is. That's the only spot we can't run to. Uh, okay, so we have a couple options. So on Ash, we could dash over here and try to get damage on this one for next round, or we can use his shot where we think this one is, and hopefully it recovers next round instead. So we could take control of the aim, turn it around, and shoot you know, by that tree. It's not a bug, it's a feature. Or we can move them here and like overwatch them that way. They're they're close to dying. I think we just get them over to Solim to heal up next rounds. We still have a shot on Ant also. Ibex, let's move. Uh, hopefully they shoot at Ibex. Like, best case scenario as far as who they shoot at. Hot Pockets, let's go ahead and do your free reload. Move you up for next round. We don't have to worry about that guy. That one's panicked, so we don't have to worry about that one. Can we get you anywhere semi-safe? That's probably the safest spot we can go. That's not great. Oh, thank goodness that one's panicked. When we spot a new enemy, that really worried me. Okay. Tet is probably screwed. Let's go. I wonder if the mist will heal them before they actually bleed out. It's hard to tell if he's even in the mist. They're out of ammo. There's nothing they can do at all. They could recover, but I mean, what are they going to do after that? Tentacle attacks, maybe? All right. So we'll end up recovering next round with them. Can move them out to try to bait some fire on them, but I doubt that's going to do anything. So all we got left is Furby and Ash. Ash, I think we have to get you to some semblance of safety. I can do it. Well, hello. That really sucks. That that eats up our entire dash. We know he's panicked now, though. So maybe we just kill. Just kill so he doesn't recover. Whip it. Whip it good. Alright. So we restored enough to dash again. do it I mean if he if he barely gets hit he's dead so we're gonna get him into uh best cover we can get him this round which I think is that full cover right there all right so all that's left is Furby and Ant Ant really can't do anything other than overwatch so that's what we'll do there so now with Furby uh he has one shot remaining I think we just shoot into this to see if we hit anything. So we take control of the aim. And uh, we just shoot right where a triton would be if it's there. And we hope that we disable a gun or we cause it to bleed or something. Hey, Tat, welcome in. They all went through, so it might not even be there. Uh, and then Ant, I'm going to set an overwatch.
It's all we can do. It's all we can do. Okay, that one bled out before the mist healed. That's good. We killed a lot that round. Oh, look at that. All the ones that were left were, um, were panicked. Ooh, okay. What happens if we just dash into this? Do we complete it? Let's find out. Secure the area. So we still have to kill everything. Okay. Okay. All right. So, Tet, you have no dashes remaining. Uh, Furry does have a dash. We know that one's bleeding out. Let's go ahead and dash over here and take this one's gun out. Wait, can we get a kill on you anywhere? Almost, but not quite. Very close. Alright, take his arm out. Okay. Uh, he just needs barely tapped. We can just bash him and he dies. We know there's at least one Triton somewhere. That's our last thing. Sign for the front desk on December 10th. Uh, I went today, Tet. The post office... D they didn't have it. I don't know what's going on. Can you get a tracking number so I can take the tracking number to the post office? But yeah, it wasn't there today. I went. Number five, right? Number five. Um, we need to find where that Triton went. There's a Triton in this mist somewhere. Maybe they sent it to you on accident? Yeah, maybe. I have had that happen before. Okay, Tet does not have a dash. Well, let's go in here with Tet and see if we see anything. God. We might just have to pull back into Overwatch. Alright, let's get Ash like healed up first off. So inventory, we're gonna move um we're gonna give that to Ash like. Okay, cost one action point worth though. Ash is gonna heal himself. It's cool that you can do that. You can give give equipment over. Ash, go there. Uh, actually, go there. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't know about hunting this. I think we just get into uh, some semblance of safety. And if we see it, we kill it. If we don't, we just get a safe... Oh, hey, oh. Found it. Okay. Lights. Promise of safety. That's right. Marco. Uh, the problem is, if we don't kill it, Tet can't move after this. This one we need to bash, right? Yeah, we'll just bash that to finish it. Up. Okay. Do we have a snipe on this one? Salim, you do not have a snipe. Uh, do you? Do you, Salim? Wait, Salim? Salim does have a snipe from right there. It's not going to be good at all. But we might take it. We'll take a look. Quick game. We had a good last night. Lafice on. Hoping it did. Uh, it went well. We hit 95% and we did three different. Uh, there were. Uh, look at that. They weren't uh, high paying bounties. They were single digits, basically. <clears throat> but still, it's more than I had before. So thank you, Inspector. How you doing, Rose? Welcome back. What's going, on, Rose? How you doing, Inspector? Check a little bit. Number five. Space two fives. Number 55. Get it? I don't know.
I can ask. But yeah, um, it's the because it, it is number five, not fifty-five. All right. I'm gonna take the shot with Tet. Hopefully that's not what happened, but. Can we disable that? No, it's gonna deal 80 damage, it's gonna have 10 left. So our best bet is to just do as much damage as possible. Take out the leg, sweep the leg. Right behind you. See if we can find it. Okay, we gotta find this thing. Because uh, Tet's gonna die if we don't find it. I wonder if we just grenade with Ivax like here. Let's do it. For that miss. So the animal is number 55 is an M2. Yeah, that would be unlikely. No, I mean, I understand. Because, I mean, I've checked three times, you know? So, I mean, I believe that you've seen it, obviously. But I believe that either the post office or... Uh, either the post office or uh, Amazon screwed up. I'm afraid I we're not gonna get this kill, and I should have just stayed back. The mist is what's really gonna screw us here. Hot pocket, no, that's ants. Ants still has rally though. You know what? Let's rally and get them into safety ish. Safety ish. We can do one more grenade here just to see. Hopefully, it doesn't go wide. How you doing, Nathan? Welcome in. There's nothing bleeding there, so I'm I'm thinking it went further away than we think it did. All right. So, hot pockets will run you forward. You got more armor than most, so I'm okay if it targets you over those two. Uh, so, Leem, we still have that sniper shot, but all right, rally the troops. It's our last rally. Gonna give everyone plus one. Three tiles from the close one. It's right there. It's right there. Why isn't it revealing? It's gotta be right there because that's where the X is. There's no other reason why we couldn't walk there unless there was an, someone there. Hi, dude, Mac. Welcome in. Welcome back, Mac. I mean, we could take this sniper shot, but I might just uh, overwatch it. So we can take a snipe where we think it is. Or we could overwatch in that direction. Try to move them. Take the sniper shot. How you doing, Kitty? Welcome back. Move through to reveal. Yeah, I mean, that's what I was trying to do, but... It's not revealing for some reason. And now Ted is completely exposed. That's really weird. It's not revealing. I think Ted's worse off than he was now. What if it's like bugged and it's not where it is? Like, really screwed. Cyber shot's really risky. Yeah. The other thing that we could do is we could try to panic it. So we could just kill this one and hope it panics. Even though we don't need to kill this one. Town at 1:51 p.m. Tracking number. If you want to ask, front desk. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll take the tracking number. Um. And ask them on Monday. Advancing. 
How you doing, Orchestra? Welcome in. How's it going, Orchestra? If this last Triton takes someone out, I'm going to be so annoyed. So annoyed. I think that's our only out, though, right? Is to either aim for that spot, hope we hit it, or we panic it with this. So we think it's to the right of... Two spaces to the right of Tet. There's Tet. So we think it's like right here. But again, I might just take this out and see if we panic it. Well, yeah, it's chameleon. Yeah, exactly. But when it's chameleon, if you get into uh, melee range, it reveals them. Um, and we've already done that once in the mist while it was chameleons. So we should have revealed it again, but we didn't. I think I'm just going to go for the panic. I think that's our... Hope, hopefully it panics off of this one kill. I think that's our primary out. Uh, all right. Get you kind of far away. Wait, we can't run there either. What if it's there? That would be very strange. That's not one. That's a bug. No, it's not there. So now we can run there. All right. Well, that's all we can do. I mean, I can move step. So it doesn't have any shots. They have better armor. They could actually take the two shots from it. It's so weird that it's not revealing, though. Like, it should reveal if it's there. But it just hasn't. In the game, not for long. Oh, you! as soon as you were in last night, your very first mission, you got down to uh, six health. Six health on your first mission. Such risky plays. Uh, ants. That overwatch would be terrible. <laughs> cool. We can overwatch out this way, I guess, in case it goes, but... Uh, at least it's a pistol one, you know? That's where it is. Yeah, it didn't reveal, even in the mist. 40. That's your life for nothing. It was to save a base. It was to save a base, Tet. It wasn't for nothing. Holy crap, we didn't lose anyone. Woo! That was a very... not great mission. <laughs> the basement, nothing to you. That's where you were born and raised. On the spaceport. That's where you spent most of your days. Chilling. Relaxing, maxing out, all cool. Until a couple of guys from another base. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do the rest of the song. You know how it goes. Zero. It's because they're max level. So max level seven. So they don't level up anymore. Unfortunately, we have not managed to recover any useful information from the site. This is not the location mentioned. Simon's note. We'll have to keep looking. Well, thank goodness. Start seeing that in my head. Just. <laughs> it's good. Now you can grab some lunch, Taff. Enjoy your lunch. We're about to do another mission exactly like it. This time we're going to go in with more ammunition, though. Maybe bring our A-team. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and a comment below. You can also subscribe to the channel by clicking this button. It helps out a ton. And after all of that, be sure to check out the next video right up here. Of course, as always, thank you guys for watching.